Hello Angel, we would like to ask you a question. What does it mean to be a Lobo? Uh, to be a Lobo, you have to be hardworking, you have a great work ethic, and you have to be very persistent. Thank you. Alright Raymond, we would like you to give us some advice for the new ERWC students. Three tips to be successful during the senior year. Alright, here are some three tips for you ERWC students. First tip is that you gotta get to class on time. Second tip is that you always gotta turn in your work early. And third tip is you always gotta have your notebook organized. Thank you. How would you like to be remembered anyhow? Well, as a fellow ERWC student, I'd like to be remembered as someone who was always participant and always willing to get the job done and just uh, <laughs> having, having my work done. This is advice to the new freshmen. What would you like to tell your freshman self? I would say um, be prepared for whatever. Like don't, pro don't procrastinate and uh, like manage your time. Okay. Three steps they can take during their first year that will lead to success. Um, get on good terms with the teacher. Um, be enthusiastic and upbeat and just be organized. Angel, would you please tell us what are some ways to get involved with the school? Uh, some ways to get involved in the school is sports. Like for example, I was in basketball. It enhances your high school experience. Thank you. So what is your favorite spot in the whole school? My favorite spot would be the cafeteria. See, this is my favorite part of the building. The quad, because this is where every single one of these people socialize, and it's a pretty cool place. As, uh, my next favorite part of this whole school is the library all the way over there. That's the quietest part of any spot of this area, because everyone's really loud. So when I need some quiet time, that's where I go to sleep. Hey, hey you, hey student, hey, hey. What's your favorite part of the whole school? Well, my favorite part of the As school would be the quad class because that's where knowledge comes from. That is, unfortunately, you guys won't be able to take your class because she'll be teaching Abbott, but she's the best student in the whole world. Student. Student. I mean, teacher. Where do you see yourself in five years? In five years, I see myself going to UCI. First, I'm going to be attending Golden West College for the first two years. yourself in five years? Oh, in five years you say? I, I think I see myself being at Santa Ana College working on my psychology degree and I'll be helping patients here and there. Hello Angel, where do you see yourself in five years? I see myself getting my associate's degree in criminal justice and I'm hopefully transferred to a four year in order to get a bachelor's degree. Where do you see yourself in five years? Well, in five years I see myself hopefully finishing community college then transferring out to a university and going to, uh, either studying fitness or business. Thank you. Hi. Where do you see yourself in five years? In five years, I go for two years in community college. Um, after that, I see if I could uh, continue my studies as an industrial architect and see if I goes from there. What do you hope to achieve in the next 10 years? In the next 10 years, hopefully get my degree like in industrial architect and get a good career that's going In the next 10 years, I hope to have a wonderful family with three kids and two loving dogs. Aww. So in the next 10 years, I hopefully want to be have a bachelor's degree in either fitness or uh, business, and I want to be successful and have uh, enough money to support. In the next year, 10 years, I plan to travel around the world, meet new people, and gather a lot of experiences. This will help me grow as a person and overall gain a lot of experiences. For the last words, I would like to add, always keep in mind what's most important for you. Always reach for your goals and try to have fun because um, it is high school. You are supposed to be happy. And I sort of forgot to enjoy my experience during high school because I had a lot of pressure on me. But, you know, uh, you will graduate. Through high school, I'd like to say that enjoy your high school experience and... Make the best of it. Work hard. We out.